Well, here we are at Orangi, the official practice courts for the All England Club. Luckily, Justin Gimmelstob, two-time Grand Slam champion, has joined us. Justin, how does it feel to be back again playing? Well, it's surreal. I never thought I'd get back on these courts after losing. 2007, my last Wimbledon, I lost Andy Roddick. Uh, last minute replacement here, Greg Wazetsky got hurt, and I put up my hand very quickly to get in the invitational double. So I'll be playing with Todd Martin, who's a good friend of mine. I had a bunch of doubles with him on the tour, and we play fourth match today against Michael Stieck, the 91 champion, and uh, Richard Krajcik, the 96 champion. So we better come out hot. Now you've been very busy doing analysis for Tennis Channel at this tournament. What do you make of the men's semifinals, and who's your pick to win? Wow, tough to, tough, tough to pick just uh, one player. All four of them are playing so great, obviously. Andy Murray's going to get that homegrown support. Nadal, when was the last time he, he lost a match in a Grand Slam? The guy's been on fire. Hasn't lost since Australia, won the French. Um, we have to, have to go with Murray. Murray beat Nadal in the quarterfinals in Australia in one of the best matches of the year. If Murray plays his best tennis, which is the combination of the offensive and defensive skills, it's a good matchup because he likes to serve in volley on this court, wide against Nadal, and he returns so well that lefty serve into his backhand side, but it's about Murray's forehand. That's his tipping point shot. If he knocks down that forehand, uh, he's uh, very tough to beat, and he'll have the homegrown, uh, homegrown support as well, so that's, a, that's the X factor. Now, uh, 